one, two. Kansas City, Kansas City, here I come. Gun to Kansas City, Kansas City, here I come. Cosmopolitan, friendly, progressive. A classic, but also cutting edge at the same time. There's an element of creativity mixed with business. The, the boldness of the building, but its future is, is uh, written all over it, along with the signatures of these craftsmen who, who right, sign their name, in a sense, in their artwork on the walls and in the floors and on the ceilings and in the light fixtures. Kansas City has, has faith in its people and faith in the future. The entrepreneurial spirit, that's what the Negro Leagues represented. We're talking about the third largest black-owned business in this country. And to remind people who live in Kansas City just how great the monarchs were. When you go to another city like New York, it's NY, or LA is LA, so it kind of makes sense when you go to Kansas City, you should say KC. Do they think you think you don't know type of Kansas City hustle? Where you take your time, wait your turn, and hang them up and out you. Now the tables turn, the lessons learned, you gotta earn yourself some trouble. Revenge like me, never sweet, you got yourself a long ride. The logo um, has parts of City Hall in it. And it reflects the stamp that, that the workmen left on this building. Well, the monarchs used to have the C and the K that linked, so we wanted to kind of reference that. And obviously all of our other sporting teams use the KC logo. So. There's no question that there is some, some historical connection there, and you can see it. A symbol that could show people that Kansas City is culturally rich. I think that's a, a really a great logo to be able to have Kansas City launch its future into. It, it, it pops for me. I think the logo feels creative, contemporary, and clean. With the reinvention of this logo, uh, I think the world's going to take notice of what Kansas City is really all about. I see our name on it. You know, it's, it's, it's not just a, a picture, it's not just an image, it's our name. Yeah, as the late, great Buck O'Neill would say when he first came to Kansas City, he said, you know, I knew I was going to the heart of America. I had no idea I was going to the center of the universe. <laughs>